We're halfway between a couple of islands at the moment. We're heading for the Yasawas, but uh, we're a bit slow to get off this morning because we uh, had a couple of engine problems. Um, but we're so we decided we'd just look for an anchorage out here in the middle of the ocean. There's a reef, you know, right here, and it's hopefully will give us enough protection um, from any storms that blow up. Although we're not quite sure which way the wind's going to be coming from. Uh, normally, it's southeast trades that way, but at the moment we've got northerly, so we might get a little bit. It might be a bit of a rocky night here tonight. But we I just caught my first fish. Woohoo! There's lots of fish around here, so we're going to probably do some more snorkeling and uh, and Dave get spear gun out and see if we can catch some more fish because it uh, looks like clear water and good viz. So, what do you reckon about this as an anchorage, Dave? Don't know yet. <laughs> I'd rather the wind was coming from the other side. Yeah. But we've just got a plan for a southerly yeah. squall through the night. So, where are you, and what's the strategy? We're at the middle of nowhere, <laughs> halfway between Yadua and the Yasawa group, and we're looking for a spot to anchor because we can't make it to Yasawa's before nightfall, and we need to anchor with light, as you can see. We wouldn't want to be doing this at dark time. Yeah. We had a, a few little dramas um, this afternoon, this evening. We went to start the engine and the starter motor has jammed up and we nearly drifted onto a reef. Um, it's just yet another little drama on the on the journey. Um, but we managed to survive it and now we're in here trying to fix up the starter motor. We've got to re-thread a, a stripped bolt and hopefully we'll be back on the road, back on the sea soon. How are we going to get deeper? We've just got to cut with the hacksaw. We came here to take this boat back to Australia, <laughs> not to rebuild it. We came here for a holiday. Oh, God. God. <laughs> together at about midnight and then we've been motoring for the last six or seven hours uh, just to get to this gap right at the top of the uh, sail and we're just going past now we're just going past the channel and uh, it looks like a beautiful uh, it's a beautiful island white sandy beaches coconuts crystal clear water we're just going over the gap right now which is about 30 foot deep we had to wait to get here at uh, this particular time when the sun's coming up so we can see the see the bottom we can just see the reefs we're looking out for bombies in the moment uh, but uh, we're back back in action again uh, we haven't turned the engine off yet it's been running now for about seven or eight hours it's going to be a little bit uh, a little bit concerned when we turn it off and start it again because when it started before it was a little bit sticky so you know, hope that everything's going to be all right, but we'll get Migaloo 2 back to Australia with a few solid adventures in between. Signing out from the top of the Yasawans. You like you're enjoying that, Bill? Mm -hmm. I was thinking, what is it? Huh? Yeah, so was special. So was special. I picked up on your thoughts, you know. Mm. Uh, Maybe I picked up on oh, yours. Picked up on <laughs> Whoa. So what have you knocked up this morning? Papaya, walnuts, sultanas, and black rice pudding with coconut cream. Whoa. We're doing it hard out here.
Well, this is a spectacular Sava Ilao Island, and somewhere around here, there's some uh, underwater caves, and we're just looking for them at the moment. We're Got a radio and to find out exactly where it is. You dive down into some chambers and the light comes through and then if you're really game you can dive through into another chamber. I just had a look and it looks pretty dark in there and uh, Dave's pretty game. You don't know where you're going, it's just dark and you don't know how far it is and if you're going to bump into someone halfway along there just as you're about to run out of breath so it's, it's a bit dodgy. That way. Peace. 